Mornings can be hectic between running to work or dropping off kids at school. And that sometimes can mean breakfast isn't always a priority. In tonight's Health Beat, Cumberland Sophie Heineman finds out if breakfast really is the most important meal of the day. We eat a lot of big breakfasts at our house. Growing up on a farm, Jerry Lynn Arn says breakfast was never missed. That's a tradition she's carried on to her own family. My kids eat fine. They got up in the morning and were hungry and cereal was sitting on the table <laughs> with milk. People say, I don't eat breakfast. Registered dietitian Tiffany Krogstad says even when busy mornings happen, feeding your kids breakfast should be number one on your to do list. It helps, you know, keep children out of the um, nurse's office so they're staying healthier. It helps children focus better. It's found that studies have found that kids actually do better in math when they're eating breakfast as well. Krogstad says your child's breakfast should consist of a good fiber, fat, protein, and carbohydrate. Even having a glass of milk with uh, toast with peanut butter on it. Eggs, unfortunately, my children will not do eggs, but if there's a perfect food, eggs would be a great choice for children as well. Not only do dietitians say you shouldn't skip out on breakfast, but it should actually be your biggest meal of the day. If you're eating an adequate breakfast, that you're not backloading your calories and then eating more at night. It really, it should be eating like a king for breakfast, eating like a prince and then a pauper. You know, so your smallest meal should be that evening meal. Krogstad says if you're having trouble getting your child to eat healthier options, something is always better than nothing. If the only thing that your child will eat is cereal, I'm okay with that, but there are some better choices that could hold the children off um, longer um, than just cereal. And for the busiest parents, Krogstad suggests prepping the meals at night to save some time. With Health Beat, I'm Sophie Heineman. For a list of healthy breakfast ideas, go to this story at kettleland.com.